Welcome back to Legendary. Hi guys, I'd like to announce some cool progress. As most of you know, I'm currently just starting out on my YouTube journey and I'm always super happy and open to receive some nice constructive feedback. To be honest with y'all, I wish that all my videos were already perfect but still a long way to go. So one of the feedback points that I received was that the loudness or volume of my voice was not always consistent. Another point was a bit of shaky footage when I was moving while recording. So I did a little research going through many blogs and recommendations from friends to compare the most suitable equipment to improve my videos. I did know that such devices exist, but I did not know what a huge difference it makes. Today, let me show you the impact of using such gadgets compared to when not using them. Firstly, I decided to shop for a wireless microphone system to provide more professional sound quality. Based on my research, I decided for the Rode Wireless Go 2. Secondly, I invested in a gimbal to stabilize the video footage while in motion. As I'm mostly using my Sony ZV-1 compact camera weighing less than 300 grams and only sometimes my iPhone, my decision was to purchase the Julian Crane M2 gimbal. Once again, I really appreciate the feedback already received and all the feedback that will come in the future to improve on my YouTube videos and my content creation journey. I'm super excited to try out the new equipment and to share even better videos with you in the future. Let's go! In this short clip, you'll see how shaky the video actually is when you do not use a gimbal. Take a look at the difference in much better quality now that I start using a gimbal. The video looks so smooth and is simply more enjoyable. Here just another example. In all videos, I try to walk in exactly the same manner to have a good comparison. Now look at the difference when walking down a couple stairs. Now we're going to compare the sound quality when using the Sony integrated microphone compared to using the Rode Wireless Go 2. This is what you hear when I simply use the camera and the integrated microphone. Let's hear how it sounds when I walk back 2-3 meters. So I did not change the volume of my voice and this is how it sounds like when you just use a simple camera. I'll be going back another 2-3 meters. So I guess now it's going to be quite tough to hear me at all because I walked back approximately 5 to 6 meters in total. So yeah, this is how it sounds like when we are just using the camera and not using... Now let's try using the Rode Wireless Go 2. You can, you can simply clip it onto your shirt like this. So now you can hear what it sounds like with the Wireless Go 2 when I'm about the same distance away from the camera. Again, now I'll walk back another two, three meters. Let's see how you can hear me now. So, now I'm about two, three meters away and I assume that you can still hear me as good as before. Let's take another two, three steps back. So I guess the sound quality has not changed at all while using the Rode Wireless Go 2. So the difference of course will be when you are outside and there's a lot of noise around you. So this microphone hopefully will get me better audio for you guys in the future. So now I'm just walking back to the camera and I hope you guys could hear the difference. I hope you enjoyed the video and with these new gadgets I hope to be well equipped to provide even better videos for you in the future. Until next week.